All praises to the Most High. Shalom, beloved brothers and sisters, Jews and Gentiles alike. Welcome. This is your humble servant, Big Levi. And uh, today is Friday, March the 4th, 2022. And it's currently 2.07 a.m. Uh, this is an encounter that I had at a fuel station this gentleman that you see right here wearing this shirt um there's an encounter that i have i find it very very strange so to speak you know what they say about wisdom of solomon uh five two the strangeness of his salvation of course dr strange you know our magical way of seeing and knowing things please follow with me uh let us look at the message. If the, if you can see, understand the message, okay? Now, keep an eye on this gentleman right here, this fellow. He, um, uh, I just pulled up to the fuel station, okay? And then um, I just pulled up right here. Watch him. He's putting a shirt on, okay? All right. He's putting a shirt on, all right? So he done pulling the shirt but there's somebody on the ground uh, a gentile so to speak okay uh, this brother so i just got out and um i was fueling up because i wasn't empty it was like 1 28 a.m in the morning the most i always got me waking up at this time to do specific things for him which i cannot uh, share so now watch him okay so yeah, he was talking to this fellow, and uh, um, and I got out of the car, so I went and do, uh, I do, I went and get the fuel ready. Okay, so um, I was listening to uh, Big Judah uh, replay of the of last night, uh, the current events, the video that he published last night. If uh, if I remember, I will put the link in there so the people can watch it. So this gentleman approached me and listened to the conversation that we are having. Okay, you're probably not going to. So what? Yeah, I would like it like that. I would like it like that. I'm for real. I'm for real. My name is Bobby Johnson. Okay. Come to me, Daddy. Love, compassion, all the disrespect, love, humanity okay so you don't find that's like something you find the people say just out of their mind like this listen to what the brother say and I'll come to you daddy with you dad I'm for real I'm for real my name is Michael Johnson and I'll come to you daddy with you love the passion all the disrespect love he said my name is Michael Johnson okay and I come to you with peace, love, and compassion. You say, I wish I was like you. I come with peace, love, and compassion. My name is Michael Johnson. All right? Let us keep on moving. Yeah, he says something and mercy. He's coming to me with peace. Okay? He come with peace, with love, compassion, and mercy, all right. I did 28 years and six months in prison, all right. 28 years, two plus eight equals 10. Step number 10, number 10, which is a number we associated with Michael. It's not actually the Archangel Michael number, but it's something that we do here, okay. But I didn't decline. I think that's what they said. I did my time. I didn't snitch on him. The man came to my mama's house. I was 19 years old. One plus nine equals ten. Again, he is that thing even recording right now? Because it seems to me, okay, let's see. 
Is it recorded? Yes, yes, it is. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, yes. He he served twenty eight years and six months in prison. Okay, twenty eight years in prison. Two plus eight equals ten. In nineteen eighties, he was nineteen years old. Okay, one plus nine, of course, equals ten. The guy that came to pick him up, he was 25, a friend of his. I mean, this is a story he's telling me, okay? I'm not making this up, and I'm not saying this dude is, uh, he, if he, he is lying or anything like that. There's so many Michael Johnson out there, okay? There's a lot, but that's what he, that's the story he told me, all right? So he said the dude come to his mom house and the, the dude said, I'm going to take your son, Michael, to a party. And he said, uh, her mother's name is Laverne. I'm not quite sure if he says something Laverne. And he said, this dude came in, a friend of his came into his, to his mother's house and said, well, um, I'm going to take you to a party, okay? And then let's let's listen to what kind of party they were going to. Okay, I believe that's uh, the inside. Let's look, look at the inside. I just find out this video anyway. I was at pump number seven, okay? And then now uh, right in front of my face, uh, there is the number 12, okay? Um, number seven and number 12, all right? Okay. I was like like that. I was like this like that. I'm for real. I'm for real. My name is Michael Johnson. And I come to you, Daddy, with love, compassion, unconditional peace, love, humanity, and mercy. I did that same day and night. I did 28 years, six months of prison. But I ain't just trying. But I do this time. I got to put that in. The man. I came to my mama's house in 1980. I was 19 years old. He was 25. The man was just a girl. He was out of no danger, dog. I was not good for a few. My mama told me I would never touch him. He came down here. Hope he didn't die away. He killed my mama to burn. He killed my mama to stay in that. He killed my mama to let's go to. I'm going to take Michael. That's my name, Michael. I'm going to take him to Carl Spring. What's his name? Son of the girl. What's your name? Mike, Michael Johnson. Michael Johnson. Okay, all right. Let me see if I can get this. All right, that's the other part. Now, listen to this, okay? I am no See, see. He's homeless. You are, mom. Um, so, you're 55 years old. Your name is Michael Johnson? Yes, sir. And uh, that's a nice shirt. He said, "Night." Let, yeah, me, see. Dude just gave this to me. let me see the, the. Let me read it. Okay, he said, I, "A dude just gave this to me." When I pull up to the, um, when I pull up to the uh, the car, I saw him putting the shirt on. He just got the shirt. He said, "A dude give it to him," and then the shirt said, "Night, uh, M." Okay, uh, night M football. I guess that's what he said. Well, let me listen to it again. Nights football and an M and there. Okay. All right. The shirt said, uh, oops, let me get this. Um, Night M football. Night football. Okay. According to Wikipedia, uh, ESPN Monday Night Football is... Oh, that's not what that is. Let me try to type it. Oh, boy, I got things on my keyboard. Uh, I'm supposed to do these things. All right, let's do this. Uh, the, it's a night... M... Football. Uh, it's a shirt... USC Night M is that what that is? Was a red shirt has a um and the number fourteen 
it was number 14. You know, right, let me put uh, night football number 14. Uh huh. Hmm. Not quite sure. I'm not too good with uh, uh, I'm not too good with it. Could be some college things. Okay, Knights football. Let, let me listen to it again. What he said. Knights football and an M and then oh, Michael no, I, Johnson. I, I know really what he said. Yeah, yeah. Knights really uh, football and M. Uh, the guy was 25 years old when this happened. And then you served 28 years in prison. Yes, sir. And then you six just. Six months. Okay, six sir. months. All right, then. Get the wrong one. All right, all right. All right. So here you go, bro. He said, "I'm not gonna stay to look at your wallet." And he said, "Um, uh, I need to get away. I'm not trying to bust a lick." And he get away from me. Okay, he get away from me. All right. He didn't want to look at my wallet, so he got away from me. And um, and I said, "Here you go, dude." And I gave him something. Hey man, you be at peace, okay? Okay. When I say you be at peace, look what will happen behind me. Okay, look at this. Look at behind me. Here you go, bro. Watch behind. Hey man, you be at peace, okay? All right, you be at peace. All right. You see what happened here? Yeah, bro. Yeah, it's all good. It's not. I want to. I just um. Look at this. I just uh. I like to talk with my people. Okay, look at this. It's one thirty-two a.m. in the morning. It's just, it's some of those things you can't make this up. You know, of course, people will be like, hey, Big Leaf, where is your little hat thing and your glasses? Again, at night, around like 1 a.m., 2, 3 a.m., something the most I've been having me doing ever since I was a kid. I just wake up in the morning, either I'm looking for food or I'm, I'm just driving around, just working around for no reason. And I'm thinking or I'm listening to something. But this time, I was listening to uh, the beloved brother, Big Judah, the video that he just made uh, about uh, current events. I'm going to see if I can, uh, um, let me see if I can put a, a link there. Uh, huh. Oh no, that's not the video. Well, he, um, that video, the live uh, current events are not quite working you know I so that's the video that i was listening and then uh i was laughing and all that and uh um oh let me see food no oh, that's right girl well he had a nice shirt uh, somebody can oops recognize the shirt and then uh again let's listen to what he said okay oops oops all right, listen. Here you go, bro. He got away from me. When 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 I was trying to give him something, he got away. He said, I, I'm not trying to look at your uh how do you call this again? He said, I'm not trying to look at your um your wallet to see how much money try to bust a lake on you. Say, I'm not trying to rob you or anything. He got away from me again. The number 12 here, number seven, okay there and then listen to what i say it's always important to say this hey man you be at peace okay okay uh, watch you this be peace, you right? be at peace watch watch behind me look at where it's coming from here you go bro look at this hey man you be at peace okay the moment uh, i say the word the holy spirit landed the moment you said you be at peace the holy spirit landed watch this again i'm not making this up here you go, bro. Hey, man, you be at peace, okay? All right, you be at peace, all right? In peace. Yeah, bro. Yeah, you talk good. It's not, I want to, I just, um, I just, uh, I like to talk with my people, okay? Yeah, yeah it's, it's all good. It's all good. It's gospel. All right, brother. Yeah, I'm not ashamed with God for Christ. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, it's yeah. all good. I know you can look young. It's all good. I know you still fan. Oh, oh, it's, it's a pigeon over there. It's a pigeon. All right. 
and then Thank he leave bro. me with what? peace. He leave me with peace. Okay, you see the dove walking, or uh, the dove, you know my accent and stuff, you know the dove and stuff like that. And then I see he leave me with peace. I leave him with peace. He leave me with peace. You can't make this up. Okay, watch this. Watch. He came in in front of the car. Okay, he said what he meant to say. You know, he talk about the gospel of Christ. Okay, those are true messengers from Christ. These are true messengers from the Most High God Himself. Okay, he say I leave you with the gospel of Christ, which is the law, brothers. It is the teaching of Yahweh about the law and how to get to the Father. That's all it is, man. It's not the worship of Christ, man. Okay, you leave me with peace. Okay, watch this. All right. All right. Thank you, bro. Go in peace. Okay, number 14. Now, number 14, I'm not... Again, I, le I, leave, him, I leave him in peace, okay? I say, go in peace. All right? So, he went in peace, okay? When he, um, when he passed in front of the car, he, I heard what he said. He said, uh, uh, in the name of the Heavenly One, you know... Okay, let's listen. All right. All Thank right. you, bro. Um, if our beloved sister Connie is listening <laughs> or watching, all praises to the most high beloved sister. Um, if you can uh, send us, <laughs> the sister can read lips or if any one of you can read his lips, he said something here. I forgot. I believe he said, may the heavenly father bless you or something like that. Or I leave you in peace or whatever. He said something and then he leave me in peace. All right. Thank you, bro. Go That's it. Number 14. Number 14. All right. All praises to the most. I mean, you can't make this up. You can't. <laughs> you can't make this up. Man. And um, <laughs> this brother right here. 1.33 a.m. in the morning. 1.33 a.m. in the morning, brothers. Okay? Let's listen to what the guy I said again. Our people, okay? Peace. You'll be at peace, okay? All right, all right. He said, I'm not, go, bro. I'm not trying to rob you. Okay, I tell him, he, I gave him something. And what I gave him is the number of Michael. I gave him Michael back. Okay, you can't make this up. This dude, and listen to him. Listen to, his, listen to what he said. Hey, man, you be at peace, okay? All right, you be at peace, all right? You peace, yeah. Yeah, go. So you will look me up. You will go on the internet and look up Michael Johnson. Like now. Nah. Yeah, it's all good. It's not. It's I want to. I just. Um, I just. Uh, I like to talk with my people. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's all good. You say, and then no, nothing wrong with that. What I tell you is the truth. Okay. This is the gospel of Christ. Listen. All right, brother. Hey, I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. <laughs> okay. Say, I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Christ. All right, those are the true messengers that the mighty one sent. Okay, that has nothing to do with the worship of Yahusha, I mean, or, or Christianity. None of this. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, yeah. it's gospel mean mean good news. The gospel of Christ mean the good news of the Lord, the good news to get back to the Father. That's that's all it means. Okay, laughing next to the uh, number seven and then number twelve right here. So you can look it's all good. I don't oh, it's a pigeon over okay. there. I just noticed that. Like 1 a.m. in the morning. 1.33 a.m. in the morning. There, there's a... And then he... All right. Okay, Thank you, bro. Go in peace. In, leave me in peace. Number 14. <laughs> Again, the guy, the dude is 55 years old. 5 plus 5. 10. Michael in the midst. His name is Michael Johnson. Michael in the midst. He got arrested when he was 19 years old. One plus nine, Michael in the midst. The guy that got him arrested was 25 years old. Two plus five, seven, as you can see, and uh, uh, perfection, as you can see right here, you can see the number, uh, number seven, okay? He told my mama in 1980, I was 19, between 19 and 20, that time. He was 30, he was 25. He told my mama they burned. I would take your son Michael to a block party. All white people have block party God's brain. Guess what, bro? We never did lose the God's brain. We made a lot of evil. 
Okay, he said this dude came into his mom's house, okay, a friend of his. He was 19, between 19 and 20 years old, and the dude was 25. He told his mom that he's going to take him to a, a black party, or white women, and call Spring. He didn't take him to call Spring. He took him to Lauder Hill. He shot a cop three times in the head. He killed the cop. He killed the cop. That's how that went. And I was in the back. He said that's how that went. He was in the back. Sometime two thirds do this. Again, I'm not doubting the guy's story. I'm just telling you what he tell me because it's a little bit low. You may not hear it. I'm just repeating because I'm a I'm a movie maker, a uh, editor, but I despise editing. So because my computer cannot handle this. So um this fellow he said uh, that he was in the back seat he said that's how he went down but he didn't snitch on the guy because that's the mentality of all people even though we're about to go down we won't go down for, because we we scared of people say hey, you snitch on the nigga man you were supposed to serve 28 years and six months you you you, you snitch and then you got out he got in well he he he, he did the crime so okay I asked him why did he do this he said the guy say he did it at the end because he wanted revenge because the police killed his brother he said man I, 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 didn't, I don't own no any gun I can't drive I didn't know how to drive yet he, he took the blame for the fellow again that's his story but that's not I'm, I'm not making this up I said, how long you went to prison? You said 28 years and six months. 28 years? He said, you, you think, you think I'm, I'm, uh, I'm lying to us? I nah, man. I believe everything you said. Because I knew the moment he, he told me the name, he said, hey, brother, I'm Michael Johnson. I'm 55 years old. I'm num uh, uh, number seven. Number 12 is right in front of me. Uh, uh, this dude, uh, he wearing a shirt saying knight. You got the knight. Michael the knight is a knight. Okay, he got the M on it. Okay, look at the shirt. The shirt. I will show you the shirt. The shirt got the number M, uh, not the letter M on it. You can't make this up, okay? Okay, he said something about the gospel of God and Yahusha or something. I'm 55 years old. I ain't playing no game. He says something about the blood of Jesus. Of course, uh, you know, we know what it means. And then you say anything else you want to know, fam? Okay, can can I ask you for mercy in the in the Lord Jesus? Uh, I believe that's what he say for mercy. I have no father. I'm homeless. I have no father. So I'm homeless. You are my. So you're 55 years old. Your name is Michael Johnson. Yes, sir. And uh, that's a nice shirt. He said knight. Let, yeah, let me see the. the let me read it. Knights football and an M and there. Oh, Michael no, I, Johnson. I, I know what he say. Yeah, yeah. Knights no uh, football and M. Uh, the guy was 25 years old when this happened, and then you served 28 years in prison. Sure. And then you six just months. okay six sure. months. All right then. Get the wrong one. All right. All right. Here you go, bro. Hey, man, you be at peace, okay? You see. All right, you be at peace, all right? You be at peace. The dove landed, bro. bringing peace. Yeah, it's all good. It's not, I want to, I just saw, uh, I just saw, uh, I like to talk with my people, okay? The dove landed. You be at peace. Yeah, and the, low, the dove landed at, at, at uh, pump number 12, okay? Watch it. I'm not making this up, brothers, okay? For the people that like thinking that I'm making this up, I'm not, man. Okay, listen. Let me see the, the. Let me read it. Knights football. Okay, this is point number M twelve right here. Oh, Michael I, Johnson. I, I know what he says. Yeah, yeah. And and it's burning. Football, I'm blowing up my. Football and M. 
Uh, the guy was 25 years old when this happened, and then you served 28 years in prison. Yes, sir. And then you just six months. Okay, yes, six sir. months. All right, then. Get the wrong walk. All right, all right. He walk away. Say, I'm not gonna look at your wallet. So here you go, bro. I think I'm driving, robbing you. Hey man, you be at peace, okay? okay. All right, you be at peace. All right. Okay. The dove landed at number twelve. Yeah. Bro, yeah, you talk good. If not, I want okay. to. I just saw. Uh, huh? I just saw. Uh, I like to talk with my people. Okay. Rock yeah. around. Yeah. Yeah, it's a talk. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank All you, right. bro. Go in peace. Now, the number that he wear, you know, it's number 14, of course. Um, uh, I'm not quite sure what uh, Gematria for number 14 is. Uh, let's look it up. Gematria number 14. The Watchman. Is that what that is? King's Ship. Uh, and this study... Um, I would like to, to examine the significance of the number 14. Uh, the, num the, the meaning of uh, 14 is uh, related to the Hebrew character that represents 14, the Yod, or Yod, 10, Michael. You can't make this up. And the Dalit, 4, the four corner, the four quarter of the universe, okay? 14 is thus represented as uh, this, the Yod Dalit. In addition to being a number, it is also the Hebrew word for hand, okay? Yad, I've been talking about my hand being on fire. The hand of the mighty one is upon us. The hand of mighty one is covering us, okay? 14 also is the number of joints in the human hand, okay? The, we have 14 joints in our hand, so that, that's the hand, okay, was there. The hand of Michael, La Palma. You know, La Palma, of course, means the palm of Michael, okay, of course. The Hebrew word for friend is Yedid. How does one show friendship? They clasp hands and handshake, okay? That was an act of friendship uh, that, well, that came in, okay? All right? Um, <clears throat> that's what that is, okay? Uh, when you shake hands with your friends and you have two hands together, Yad Yad. Yad dispels out Yedid, friend, Yedid, has the numerical value of Kohak, strength, 28. The dude spent 28 years in prison. I am not making this up. Is that thing even recorded? Is this thing even recorded right now? Because people think like I'm making this up. I am not. He, is 20, he went and he served 28 years in prison. Of course, 2 plus 8 equals 9. <laughs> 2 plus 8 equals 10. <laughs> Michael in the midst, okay? When you shake hands, no one has the upper hand. You are both equal. That is the only way that true friendship can exist when both parties are equal. And it's a form of agreement. You know, when you shake hands, all right? Ye did Gematria number eight twenty eight shake hand. He, he served excuse me. He served twenty eight uh um twenty eight years. Okay, friends enough need. All right. Our sages teach that the number fourteen symbolize the strong hand. Who has the strong hand? The mighty one. Okay. Or Yad Hak Zaka of Moshe. Okay. Who was the recipient of the Torah? Sefer Yad Hakzaka is also the subtitle of the Minesh Torah, a code of Jewish law, Kalakka by Mahimonid. The Minesh, the Mishneh uh, Torah, is regarded as Mahimonid Magnus Opus. The work consists of fourteen books. Mahimonid also wrote a book a titled Sefer Had Mitzvah, the Book of the Commandments. If you can get this book, get it. This book set forth a series of fourteen roots, which is which are general principles for identifying, enumerating, and classifying the Torah's mitzvah. mitzvah. Finally, also, uh, what uh, a book. Uh, the guide for the perplex is this book he informs that he has uh, divided all the commandments into 14 classes okay all right so you can read the other one i'm not making this up man okay yakov left his parents home and bear okay okay jacob you know jacob uh, left his parent and bear shiva at the at uh, age 63 but arrived and uh charon 14 years later at age 77 okay i'm not making this up there's plenty number 14 here uh Ber uh Berishit, uh genesis 31 41 does have been 
uh, 20 years in thy house, I serve thee 14 years for thy two daughters. Okay, Jacob served 14 years, seven for the first daughter, seven for the other daughters. Okay, 14 is like a, a number of completion, double completion. Okay, all right, um, uh, thy daughters, and six years for thy cattle, and uh, thou hast changed my wages 10 times. Okay, 10 times, uh, Michael, or you have changed my wages 10 times. From previous verse, we know that Yaakov worked seven years to uh, earn Rachel and receive Leah. He then worked an additional seven years to acquire Rachel. The 14 years are made up of two sets of seven, perfection. Further, these two sets of seven were for the purpose of securing and providing for his wives. I know I'm going to receive a lot of crap. People like, oh, well, you know, he was wicked. He had two wives and stuff. The Bible said, and, and, and I'm following this guy. He said this. Yeah, that's on you, dude. Okay. Uh, the suggestions that the meaning of 14 is the strong hand of Hashem to acquire and take care of his beloved bride. Okay. The strong hand of Yashem. Hashem. Okay. That's the message here, brothers. I'm not making this up, man. Okay, you can go ahead and read the other one uh, on your own. You, they mentioned 13 and 14, all of this. Okay, this is a pretty good website. I uh, I never, um, you know what, let me bookmark this one. Um, uh, let me bookmark this so I can have it on my computer. Get done. Okay, so we know now the number 14 is the strong hand. Okay, when it, when it, wherever we say we see the number 14, the strong hand. Okay, now what I came up with the message that I got, I got from number 14. Okay, the five pointed star pentagram. According to Wikipedia, a pentagram is the shape of a five pointed star polygon. Now, the pentagram has a horrible. A reputation because they took it they flip it upside down but when they, when in when in, in reality the pentagram you know is a representation of men a man you know and the pentagram is like double it's it is well known and esoterically to mean the pentagram of michael the that's like the pentagram that frustrated all demons that's why they have to take it and flip it upside down and perverted it and invited demon in because this is michael standing in the gate with his hand open like you won't get in you can't get in Okay, why I say the uh, 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 the five point one two three four five the five point fourteen in the back of his shirt right there. Okay, uh, okay, you can see the number fourteen. Let me just uh, pull it back a little. Okay. All right. Okay, he put the hand. You see the hand? Let me force it. Okay. Force All right. It. Okay, this is the hand number fourteen. The hand of the strong one okay the hand of the strong one is upon you not me though brothers okay this is a message for the nation all right is upon all of us i'm not making this up man okay i'm not i am not just trying to make this up as if like oh oh uh, hey i'm trying to get views or whatever D this is real i did not pay this dude to do this or i just go over there the most i wake me well i was studying <sighs> somebody's calling okay who's calling me in one am apology that's our beloved sister sister rita i can't talk to her right now i don't want this thing to uh get out of my mind while i have it here uh because to the sister it's uh it's 10 p.m okay she she thought like i have the same stuff but anyway the same timeline but anyway um uh what time is it now 2 42 a.m all right uh let's see where we were so the strong hand okay he raised his eyes okay uh, uh, uh look at the heaven okay he pray he put the strong hand number 14 upon us now we know something about number 14 now wherever we saw the number 14 we know the strong hand of the mighty one is upon us of course michael is in the midst that's who he sent okay 14 is the strong hand we call it the strong, strong hand of the mighty one michael is watching over and he bring us peace blessing and mercy everything that he said here brothers that's that's what it is okay let me see the number in the back of the Thank shirt you, bro. okay you can see the number 14 here all right number 14 all right 
I'm not making this up. Go in peace. And I let him. And number fourteen. Go in peace. Oh, praise the most. I mean, you can't make this up. You can't. <laughs> you can't make this up. And um, this brother right here. You know, and I wonder. I sometimes, sometimes the mighty one. He had me on. Now let me pause with Judah right here. I'm releasing to, uh, to the stuff that he's saying. The Most High, God Almighty, sometime he had me wake up in the middle of the night. It's 1.32 a.m. He had me drive around. You know. Okay, he had me drive around. Listen. Sometime, most, most of the time, I'm looking for food. And sometimes I'm just driving, just clear my head. Okay, that's what, what was going on. Now, there is another video. Another thing happened. Listen to what happened that night. The, before that, something strange happened again. Uh, I had so much on my plate. So, I decided to... Um, take a drive. Get out the house. And take a little drive around and stuff. And uh, first, I went to a place, and I met a sister. And this sister that I met over there, she she could not talk straight, but she asked me for five dollars. And she came in and into my window. I think I have uh, I have the video. I have the video, but again, the people will not understand it. They would not see. They can't, for instance, I will receive a lot of crap people trying to tell me all the thing because they can't, they are unable to see what happened there. That's why I won't show the video. And because the people would not understand what happened. Let me explain to you what happened. I was driving around again, like I told you, my, the, the mighty one wake me up all the time in the middle of the night. And then he put something in my mind. He said, go ahead and do this i never fight against him and put my own understanding before him so i just get off you know 1 a.m 2 3 a.m i just get out of the place you know and i just start walking around and or driving around and go to the place that he told me to go i don't i don't question the most i i don't put my own um my own understanding before before him and trying to explain to him oh i'm not gonna go in this place Oh, they got this, they got that. I watched this dude. This woman say this about this person that I don't say this. I just obey and do this. So, when I got there, let me see if I can play, Um, um, the. F uh, give me a second. I think I can play some of it. Okay. All right. I think I have, uh, I, I can play this. Okay. Watch this and listen. All praises to the most high. I give the most high praises and glory first. Now, there's a couple people here. Now, there's this young woman right there. Okay. See her? Running, running to me. Okay. She's running over there to me. And um, she stopped me. Okay. She stopped me. All right. I'm not going to show her face, but she, she stopped me. And uh, I had uh, that thing in my ear. All right. I had uh, the phone. I was listening to Big Judah again. Okay. This happened in one like 50, uh, uh, 12, 50, 57 a.m. Okay, about like thirty, about like thirty-five minutes before the other the other event happened. Okay, excuse me, I can hear her. I'm sorry, what? Bless me, man. Oh, I say bless me, uh, bless me, man. She said, bless me, brother, bless me. Uh, but you, she, her speech is uncomprehensible i i know why okay she said Bl bless me uh, yeah. oh. okay listen i'm sorry what bless me man oh yeah. like it's on fire no i'm on fire I'm let me see if i got some change i think i had some change in here somebody made me take a what is it, sis? What is it you say? Can you can have five dollars. She, I, it, it took me a while to understand what was going on, and I'm like, why is her speech is all? Oh, okay, that's what that is. I'm trying to um. 
There you go. Okay. You heard what she said? She's like, um, she said, uh, um, she, uh, she like, she take the money and then she jump around and then she, she, she was so happy. She said, um, she made the, um, uh, the kissing, uh, she said, made, she made the kissing gesture. She was so happy. She said, thank you. She said, um, I, I, you too clean for me. She said, I'm too clean or you too clean for me? Something like that, she said. But she cannot speak straight, okay? Me too clean, sir. Okay. You, you too clean for me. Right. And her voice changing and she starts speaking another language. Listen. Okay. All right. Her, her voice changed like a child. Okay, child of the Most High, give the Most High great praise, great glory. And she she take the the money for me, and she um she she like oh she jump around, and then she she jump around and she she make the the uh, the the kissing sign with her hand. She kiss her hand and show me her hand. Of course, the hand again. And then I kiss my hand and I show my hand to her. And then she's so happy. And then she she say you too clean for me. And she said something. I, I don't know what she said. She said something in, in whatever language she said. And then she skipped back uh, to uh, the, the the people that she were with that night. And she left. And I give the mighty one praises and glory. So I keep on going. You know, I keep on going because I obey. So, okay, the, the five star, you know, they perverted it, turned it upside down so they can invite demon in and stuff like that. Okay, this is a perversion. Okay, there's nothing wrong with it. It's just a perversion. Okay crazy thing man so yeah um i am not making this up everything that you heard here everything that you see uh it is real okay it is real um and the most i sent strong message to the nation okay that uh, the strong she's strong hand is uh watching us his strong hand of course is upon the gentiles against their loin and uh, he is, of course, in the midst of watching uh, uh, his children. He sent peace, blessing, compassion, uh, uh, mercy. Okay, one of the strong words. Say mercy. The dude say mercy, and he raised his hand. Okay, above the heaven. Okay, uh, above to the heaven, towards the heaven. He he said something. I I don't know what he said. The sister read lips. She can put this in the comment board, and she bless. Uh, the car well at least the car i was inside of the car then she, he blessed me and then he left the same sister did the same thing she blessed me with a kiss okay um uh jacob kiss esau uh abraham a, a kiss is uh let me see what's uh the 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 biblical meaning of kiss uh well, I, I, let's see wait did i say did i say gematria did it i think i read it somewhere here kiss Kiss. I saw red somewhere here. That's a kiss. Let me see. Find kiss. Oops. I think I did. Huh. Uh, let me see what they have that. Oh. King. Huh. Well, kiss is like a greeting, just like shaking hand. Anything. Let me see the gematria. What's the meaning of gematria? Meaning of kiss. Uh, gematria meaning of kiss. Oh, yes. I don't think. Well, gematria means with number. Uh, Hebrew gematria value of forty forty nine. Okay, but anyway, kissing kiss is a symbol of peace. Okay. Uh, what does the spiritual meaning of kiss? I should have said biblical According yeah. to Massey University, history has it that biblical heroes such as Moses, Aaron and Jacob, left this world for a better one as a result of a kiss from God. Many ancients felt that the kiss signified a death of the past, a renewal of self, and a rebirth into a higher world. You can't make this up. You cannot make this up. 
I'm not making this up. Let, let, me, let, me, let me let you hear it again. What does the spiritual meaning of kiss? According to Massey University, history has it that biblical heroes such as Moses, Aaron and Jacob, left this world for a better one as a result of a kiss from God. Many ancients felt that the kiss signified a death of the past, a renewal of self, and a rebirth into a higher world. All praises to the Most High. Now, to the profane, it's a kiss of death. And to us, that's, that's not what that is. It's like it's the death of the past, signifying a death of the past. Okay, the Most High forgave the past for us. The past is dead, and we have a renewal self, a rebirth into a higher world. Which world? Jacob world. Which world? Yasharala world. You can't make this up, man. The sister gave me, uh, uh, I, when I gave it, she said something to me in another language. Or uh, gibberish, I'll say. Uh, nonetheless, she said something in gibberish. She said, oh, you know, I said, oh, my God. And, and she said, mm -hmm. she kissed her hand and, and blow the kiss at me. And then I kissed my hand. I blow the kiss at her. And then she was so happy. And then she ran to the, the group of the fellow that she was. And she said something to them. And then I laugh and I say, hey, this is the child of the Most High. I just did what the Mighty One put in my mind. And then I left. Okay. I left. So that's what happened that night. And then I met the fellow. His name was Michael Johnson. Again, beloved brothers and sisters, Jews and Gentiles alike. I'm not making this up and I'm not looking for clout. I just say this, you know, to let the nation know that. Yes, indeed, the Mighty One is watching over us, and uh, he's there, and he's very, he's very, he's very worried about us. He's very cared about us, and uh, he's very passionate and grateful toward us. And we must return the favor. The Mighty One is here. He said he loved us. He sent his mercy. He sent uh, the forgiveness of the past, the death of the past, and the renewal of selves to a higher world that is why that is what we are going into with the kiss okay um again uh i will have crap people trying to explain to me other things about why why she was trying to kiss you and why trying to was to kiss her uh why this dude uh, uh he, he, he why he come to to your car he was wearing number 14 number 14 mean the elite and the illuminati of course and may anyone that uh, speak great things against the mighty one be accursed may great judgment come against them and against their loin their generation after their generation may they be them in the depth of hell and rot and suffer there for eternity i will not get your garbage if you have whatever you want if you if you can bring something positive for the nation for the most high please don't bring nothing at all just leave and then go somewhere where somebody is bringing fear 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 about jacob's trouble we are not here about jacob's trouble oh jacob's trouble it's not happening stuff like that wait a minute those are people over there in uh, ukraine over there you're killing and destroying people over there uh, jacob's trouble this is his trouble gentiles tribulation some 83 tribulation all we have to do, we receive the message. The mighty one say he forgave us. He forgave our past. He bring, he bring us mercy, truth, peace, and, uh, and ultimate love. And then the kiss of forgiveness. Okay. The kiss of peace. That's why when Esau was chasing Jacob to kill him, and then they both fell on the neck. It's an expression mean they hug. Kiss mean they kiss on the cheek or in the forehead. All right. People, they always want to take those things and, and, you know and perverted it okay um uh it, it's a, it's a kiss that's why it's a kiss of uh, um of reconciliation you know it, it's a kiss of uh, forgiveness okay and that's why judas kiss yahweh is he kiss him as a a, a a a sign of forgive me i betrayed you but of course in this context that's that's not what that is okay so beloved brothers and sisters be at peace okay fast pray repent repeat may the king reign forever you know, I'm not making this up. Be at peace. There will be no Jacob's trouble.